Knoxville for the first time, University of Tennessee Army and Air Force ROTC members paid tribute with a stair climb at Neyland Stadium. 10 News reporter Lauren Lovett went to the climb and met up with members of the ROTC who shared what it means to honor the thousands of lives lost on 9-11. UT ROTC members got up early this morning to honor everyone who died on 9-11. Army ROTC member Sean O'Hara wasn't alive when 9-11 happened, but says it's important to memorialize. It's not something we went through, but it's something we never want to see again. It's not something anyone wants to go through. Another member in his program, Jared Wright, says he remembers exactly what he was doing when planes struck the Twin Towers. The teachers had the TV on, and I actually remember seeing the second plane hit the other building. And we started hearing the news about the other planes, uh, the Pentagon in uh, uh, Pennsylvania. And it was unreal. We didn't know what to think. We didn't know what was happening. He served in the military for 12 years. While he's never done a climb like this, he says he was prepared physically and emotionally. It's kind of a physical semblance of the buildings themselves, yes, but the effort to go through and it's the walking and the remembering with each step you remember each life that was lost you remember each floor of the buildings that collapsed you remember all the lives everyone that went overseas afterwards all the damage and the destruction lieutenant colonel damian johnson says it's not only important having the climb at neyland it's special. The ability to run in Nayland to memorialize this is, is very special. It's the first time we've done it. Uh, we anticipate we're going to do it in the future as a recurring event. In Knoxville, I'm Lauren Lovett. And Robin, it was a stunning day for anyone who was alive at that time. Mm -hmm. As we heard, many of those young people were not alive, but still recognizing the sacrifice of the victims. But, I mean, you were here for the response in East Tennessee, like few other places in America. I will never forget how in the days after, as we mentioned, this community came together wanting to do something. Pennies. Pennies, pennies. People getting money from their piggy banks, kids making that contribution of a million dollars to buy that truck, what an impact it had. And um, I, I, every day, on this day every year, that memory comes back of how this community, this country rallied around those lost.